CBS 2 is teaming up with our partners from New York Common Pantry to bring awareness to food insecurity. It's all part of our Better Together Season of Giving campaign. CBS 2's Shosh Pedrosian reports on how they're helping to feed the most vulnerable people in the Bronx. In the comfort of a town home off Waterbury Avenue. So breakfast, lunch, dinner. A group of South Asian women are learning the basics of English. The, the class that we're having today is for women who are actually starting from zero. The quiet, tight-knit space teaches and encourages women to speak with confidence. Essentially survival skills so that if they're walking on the street, if they get lost or there's an emergency, they know what to do and what to say. And to speak with native speakers like me. So hello. I'm a, fine. Fine. I'm Shosh. What are some foods that you eat for dinner? Fruits. Fruits. Like fruits. SEPNA NYC provides essential social services to help new immigrants adapt to systems in the U.S. that are difficult to navigate. They don't have access to the same information um, because so many of them don't really have English proficiency. The small nonprofit recognized the food insecurity that impacts this community. They partnered with New York Common Pantry to distribute food packages every two weeks to women in their programs. And a lot of the, the bags actually go to some of our most vulnerable community members. And so many of them are survivors of domestic violence. They're undocumented. There may be newer immigrants. Bag by bag, the group says the partnership allows these women to benefit from programs they wouldn't be able to find on their own. Having an organization like SUPNA can actually bridge those barriers and, and make sure that we're reaching all the different populations that really have that need. In Unionport, the Bronx, Shosh Pedrosian, CBS 2 News. Shosh is our community reporter for the Bronx. If you have any story ideas, you can reach out to her at bronxtip at cbs.com.